Well, hello everybody out there in Cyberland. <clears throat> My name is Marlon. The channel's Old Fart Hacks. And what we're going to talk about right now is a problem I had with my brand new Shars 250-00 tool, tool, tool holder. This is the one that's used for regular tools and it also because of this groove right here. Can you see the groove? Are you groovy? Oh, there we are. I don't know if you can catch the groove or not, but there's a groove on the bottom of these, so you can use it with boring. So you can use it for normal turning, for boring, for facing. I also was using it a while back to drill these little holes in these Lincoln Navigator pivot pins that go on my navigator for my power running board step, that, where the bushings freeze up and the bearings, the running boards stick down and you go, oh, rats. And all that other nasty stuff. But anyway. So. I called up Shars after realizing this had a problem. I'd had the tool post on the lathe for about. Oh. A week. Called him up. Sent him a video of it. In fact the, the prior video where I actually complained about this project. Problem. And they uh, took care of it. But let me show you the problem first of all. Observe this. Screw right here. Watch the tip. Let's see if I can get it in there good. Do you see that screw down here wiggling around? Primarily it's back and forth. That's because they drilled the hole, then they drilled it again, then they tapped it on the wrong angle and then tapped it again. So this one is junk actually. Of course you could always come in with an oversized screw and make that a number eight instead of a number six, but so let's get rid of that one. The nice people at Char's quickly dealt with this and they sent me out a new 250-002. You can even see it, 250-002 right there. Now I've already had this out of the package because I just couldn't wait. But um, again, I like the, the Char's quality overall. Aside from they did, you know, it's they do buy them out of China and they occasionally get a bad one. So the one thing we want to check now, since we've had that problem, is um, are these screws tight? And there's still a little wiggle in the holes, actually. I will send them a little, little note on that as well, that they're having a problem with the oversized drilling. But at least these ones fit squarely. And so, I'm not doing this in the center, am I? And so, um, they'll be acceptable. Anyway, again, this one's used for both regular turning and with a bar down the middle here for uh, boring bars and such. Let's see, do I have anything else I want to tell you guys? I, I just, I'm overall quite happy with jars in general. They, everybody has a bad day, I guess, and of course I wish they had better quality control so this wouldn't happen at all, but blah, blah, blah. Anyway, if you find this useful, please whack the like button and perhaps think about subscribing. I hope you guys have a great day, and remember the key to having one is don't get caught. Bye all.